안녕하세요. 제 이름은 나미입니다. Hi, it's Nami, and today we are going to throw a surprise at you because um my blue washed out real fast, like in two weeks. But I feel like it washed out really pretty. Like my hair became like a cool platinum, and the colorista is still in my hair, but it turned a little bit more aqua than it was previously. Yesterday, I was doing makeup for a wedding, and one of the bridesmaids' sisters asked, "Who did your makeup? It looks great." And I was like, "Oh." Later, she told me this story. I was like, "Oh." And then she said, "Oh, her name is Nami, and she's actually a guest at the wedding as well. She's the one with white hair and blue highlights. That's how she described me." So I've been white-haired and blue highlighted, I guess. And we're going to throw on a new color. But first. Shampoo. Please don't fall and break camera. <laughs> I'm only gonna shampoo because I don't want the conditioner to act as a barrier between the color and my hair. But I do want to shampoo to remove any of the leave-in conditioners that have been keeping moisture in my hair, so I can prevent it from keeping color out of my hair as well. My hair still looks blue a little bit while it's wet, but when it's dry, I find it looks too much. Like it's platinum, and I want to throw in another color. I did want the blue to stay a little bit longer than it did, but Michael told me that it would be good to change it up a bit. And I wanted to try green as well because I really liked how Shuba's mint hair looked. Because I didn't condition or put any leave-in conditioners, my hair is breaking a bit. Ooh, don't want it to be dripping. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be on my head. Every time I change my hair color, I'm like, "This is happening!" Oh my gosh, it's gonna look like seaweed. So sometimes I get comments, some concerned, some annoyed, that I should leave my hair alone and let it rest a bit, or like stop damaging your hair. But every time I color my hair, I'm actually not damaging it because of the type of product that I'm using. I'm using a mask type color. And for those who actually watch our videos, I'm so sorry to have to say this again and again, but these colors are vegetable based dyes. They are semi permanent, so they don't actually stay in your hair. Oh my gosh, I actually almost look like Shrek. These products aren't really like bleach or dye with the same chemicals in them that open up your hair pores. Which are called cuticles to deposit color. Instead, the color just sits on top of your hair and just washes out. There's not really actually a chemical that goes in and changes the structure of your hair, like most dyes and all of bleach does. So the only time I'm actually damaging my hair is when I actually bleach and tone my roots. Another good thing is that this product is actually made as a mask, a deep treatment, a deep conditioner with lots of good. Nourishing and moisturizing ingredients. So while your hair is going through the coloring process, it's actually also getting treatment through the mask properties. To be honest, I don't really feel that bad when people are saying that I should leave my hair alone or that I keep damaging my hair. But I just feel like a lot of people are misunderstanding—not me, but. Hair products and the products that I'm using. So I guess I just wanted to make a disclaimer so that you understand and you know that what you are saying is actually not really that relevant <laughs> to this current situation. I don't know why some parts still look platinum, like here. Maybe I just have to throw more color pieces on it. The thing also about leaving my hair alone is that because it's already been overprocessed, when I first bleached my hair and we ended up bleaching it like four times just within a few days, my hair had already become overprocessed. So that means now all I have left to do is take care of it and make sure it doesn't become overly dry, brittle, and fall off. Which is what would actually happen if I leave it alone. Because once your hair is overprocessed, you have to keep. Helping it maintain moisture and leaving it alone isn't really going to help your hair to recover at all. Unless what is meant by leaving it alone is to stop bleaching it. But the only time I'm bleaching it is to redo my roots. And when I redo my roots, that's just it. I'm just doing my roots. So even though I do reply to some comments clearing up some misconceptions, I thought that I'd also talk about it all fully in a video, especially while I'm. 
changing my hair color so quickly after I just did the blue. This is actually not going to affect my hair because it's not bleach, it's conditioner based. This is a hair mask. It doesn't have chemicals that change the structure of your hair. And if I actually leave my hair alone, it'll become dry, brittle, matted, and like flake off. So just to put it all out there, I hope like everyone's misconceptions are better understood. Again, it's not for me, it's not for me to be understood, but just for you to have more knowledge, I guess, because like what you're saying doesn't make sense sometimes. Let's leave this in for 10, 15 minutes because that's maximum amount of time that semi-permanence will take to coat your hair. It's not like a hair dye where the hair shaft or the hair pores have to be opened up. The color has to be deposited for a process of like 40, 60 minutes. I'll be back in 10 to 15. Yes? Yes. The light is broken? Green? Yes. <laughs> what do you think, Zeke? Do you like it? Yep. Yeah? Mmm, smell. Mmm, yummy. Mm, yummy. Oh no! Zig, my face. Makeup, makeup dirty. Oh, are you eating me? Um, um, um. Okay, too much, too much. <laughs> Mommy's hair candy? Green candy hair? <laughs> hey guys, look at my hair! One, four. Wow. Yeah, look at that. You remind me of uh, Shrek. Mermaid. 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 I look like a Shrek. Mermaid. Oh, I got green here, Zeke. Oh that's no. A nice color. You blend it to seaweed. <laughs> Maybe that smells like gum. Yes, it smells very Ooh, minty. Very minty. Minty oh. smell. See, it smells so smelly. I'm washing my hands, right? It's like oh, that yeah, smells like garbage more. Hey. hey, hey. I you know what it is, Galahad? It's Teenage Ninja Min Ninja, Ninja, Ninja Mutant Ninja Turtles. Oh, I feel like Fiona. Michael has gout. <laughs> we just came back from his parents. I liked the blue better. I like the green more. You like the green more? Yeah. I feel like after it fades, and maybe if I use um, no yellow shampoo, make it purple shampoo, then it'll look a little bit mintier. And it looks it'll look, minty now, no? No, it looks lime. Doesn't it look like lime-ish? Like there's a lot of yellow tones more than a cool minty mm. green. Yeah, so after I turn it more minty, I think I'll like it better because when I look at myself in the mirror, I'm like, oh, it's sugar, kind of. But I want it to be like, Look in the mirror. Oh, it's sugar. Mm. You know, kind of like how the blue did. Right. So I think after that, I think I'll like it a lot more. I like it. It's interesting. Yeah, it it's look. funny how many people thought that my hair turned green rather than from me dyeing it. Yeah. Yeah. Even though my hair faded from the blue almost to a white. Yeah. And then I put green on it. Mm. But people thought that the blue turned green. Mm -hmm. From like white to green. And did you wash it yet? Or <laughs> I didn't wash it yet. So, I mean, I just did it yesterday. So, after I wash it, I'll show you how it looks. It'll probably look mintier. Today's feature comment is from Junk Beach. Hit me with that boop 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 blue. Hit me with that boop 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 blue. Boop 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 blue. Blue 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 blue. I actually really love it. Oh, a peekaboo style. Different color with the blue. I'm kind of in love with it. I didn't think that I would like it as much as I do, but I really love it, even though I really love blue already, but I really love it like more than I thought I would. It's amazing. So that's it for this video. If you'd like to see more, definitely don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell notification to become part of our Nacho Fam. To our MVP Nacho Fam, shout out because I know you already on that merch. I post daily stories and other photos on Instagram. So definitely check those out and I will check you out on these other platforms as well. Subscribe to our family channel right here for double the content, double the fun. Double the fun. <laughs> I'll see you next time. Bye.
Bubba, bubba, blue. Do, 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 do.